Top of the morning. And the rest of the day to you. Thank you, sir. Right, we're just about to leave Big Cabs. Day six, the first five days have just been awesome. They've been incredible. But there's more to come. So now we're going that way, which I thought we were going the other way, so we're, I'm already lost. I've just got out of the driveway. So it's been bloody brilliant. We've seen amazing stuff. It's been all just super. And if you think I've been watching too much Hippodrome, you're probably right. So let's get on with the tour. Since leaving here the first time, yep. I'm on 88676, so yeah, not far from the big number, and 1793, woo! Wow, that's really good. You're going to double that easy. Yeah. Did he come out at you? <laughs> just, just missed me. He just skidded to a stop. Was oh he dear. Did he go down the left? No, he went up the embankment. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> That's what I said. I was, I was just about to say, you know, you see the wallabies here. Yeah. Normally they'll just leave you alone and they'll jump down the side. Rarely they'll jump in front of you. No. Nah. made a liar out of me. <laughs> Oh look, it's T2. T2 power station, Jim at T2 power station. You had a little tour through there, yes? I did, it was awesome. This is all very pretty, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, it feels even colder now. It'll warm up real quick as soon as we hit the sun. Yeah, it's <coughs> Wow, look at the mist on the water. Beautiful. Uh, yes, uh, do you remember when I was showing you underground power station where the water goes? Yeah. Well, that's where it comes out. Right. Kilometers <coughs> through the mountain there. <laughs> Amazing. I don't think I hit it. No. <coughs> I heard a clunk, but I think it was him skidding on the road. Oh, yeah. Do you have ABS? ABS, yeah. Might have been the ABS clunk. Quite a bit too. Hey. And now it's uh, windy, twisty, windy uphill. All right. Oh wow. The view just opens up. Oh, Brumby! Oh, wow! Little tiny one. Oh. I was just about to say, I've never seen a Brumby. <laughs> there. Oh, a 50 speed limit. You know, you know what that means? Coffee? Good morning, country people of uh, New South Wales still? Yeah. Yep. Holy dooly. Well, you know then. Yeah, it certainly has changed the old weather. Yeah, it'll get hot for me, yeah. Yeah, yeah it's going to be hot today, isn't it? Very hot. Right, had a nice little coffee stop at Tumbarumba. 
and uh, we didn't stop at the bikers cafe over there there was a load of bikes parked there and that we saw a few adventure bikes take off they had all the adventure gear all the most expensive gear and you know the big expensive adventure bikes and uh, pristine pristine absolutely I'm pretty sure they'd turn around if they saw roadworks <laughs> <laughs> he must have been a biker. They gave us a wave. Oh yeah, beautiful pine plantations. Got to get our timber from somewhere. Ah. We've got a man trying to put it up an umbrella ahead. Do we go past? I don't know. Oh yeah, he's waved us through. <laughs> oh, oh, look at that. Cows and sheep as well. Yep, well all the grass in the paddock's gone, so yeah. they're in the long paddock. Yeah, they call that the long paddock. <laughs> oh, just ha eat your grass and be happy. But yeah, you just want to eat the road. That's you're weird. There's always one, isn't there? Yeah, and it's you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Oh, for God's sake. Seriously? Thank you. Good night, team, man. Right. The Murray River. Oh, where it actually really is a bloody river. Look at that. That's beautiful. And then it, then it goes inland and the fucking cotton farmers in cahoots with the government have stolen the fucking water. Yeah. That really shits me. You ought to see the way they use it. They just <coughs> pour it straight into a paddock. Yeah. Welcome to Victoria. Hey. Right. Go right, oh. go right, 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 right. Oh, we're in Victoria. My first time ever riding my motorbike in Victoria. There you go. So it was also my first time in ACT, so it's two new states, people. Historic moment in cranky time. Take me to cranky time. No, 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 it's not it. <laughs> Mount Alfred Gap. Oh, wow. Isn't that something? How many cases have you raked up on it now? Uh, 88,888. Well done. Thank you. Got to get a little picture for posterity. <laughs> Historic moment there. Falco has done 88,888 kilometers. And every single one was bloody awesome. So that's very interesting. Last year on the way to the Ostrov meet, I passed 77,777 kilometres. This year on the Ostrov meet, I passed 88,888 kilometres. And you were with me then too. Alright, so we're now heading along this little valley towards the Victorian high country. We came out of the New South Wales high country this morning through some beautiful roads and valleys and now we're heading off into the Victorian high country. And this should be awesome.
No, that would have been a good spot for the camera. <laughs> Parachute has just landed. A paraglider, probably. Yeah. Right, stop for lunch in Mount Beauty. Thirty-six degrees. Oh my God! No wonder I'm melting. Thirty-six degrees. We have people. It's uh. Kind of punishing to ride in, but we just have a short, short ride to go. I hear a dickhead. Squid! The dickheads everywhere. Wow, bloody hell. <laughs> don't do <laughs> Don't do a bill, don't do a bill, don't do a bill. Yeah. Don't be like Bill. Keep both your panniers firmly attached. I don't want to run over your gloves. Uh, 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 I'm in a magnanimous mood. All right, we're here, and it's stinking hot. While well, we're filming, let's show you all the cottage. The key opens the door. Oh, it's air conditioned. Ah, ah. It's got a nice big lounge room, kitchen, toilet. Double in there. Ah yes, this will be my room. So that's my room. And uh, this is Kev's room. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be Kev's room, I would believe. Wait a minute, let me see. Uh, Houston, we have a problem. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we're here. It's air conditioned. Fucking awesome.
All right, we're at the uh, V-Spell meet and vote. They're all in there. What, what a roady bunch of fucking people. They're all in there just fucking... Can you hear them? Yeah. This roady bunch of bloody adventure riders. Anyway, I got here and they didn't have a badge ready for me. Everybody else has got a badge. It says, you know, John Smith and what the fuck anyway. They didn't have a badge for me, so I made my own badge. I'll just show you my own badge. Yeah, take that, you beast lovers. 